wildlife killing contests happen all over the country. Um, they are organized events in which participants compete for entertainment, cash and prizes, for killing the most or the heaviest of carnivores, whether that's coyotes, bobcats, foxes, wolves, um, mountain lions. And we have found that at least five of these contests have occurred in Oregon in recent years, and all of which have involved uh, killing coyotes. Wildlife killing contests um, really are violate the ethics of fair chase, and they're grossly out of step with modern science-based wildlife management. Not only cruel and callous, they send the wrong message, one of disregard for wildlife, and it, you know, rather than sportsmanship and good stewardship and the respect for public wildlife. And that's why we, as a larger coalition, are accompanying here with our coalition partners. We're grateful for Oregon state lawmakers who have introduced Senate Bill 723 to end wildlife killing contests that for far too long have occurred in the shadows of Oregon and not anymore. On December 2nd, 2018, HSUS investigators recorded undercover video of the check-in portion of the Young Farmers and Ranchers first annual coyote hunt in Hines, Oregon. There was no limit for the number of coyotes that could be killed during the three-day contest, and the announcement for the killing contest is included in your packet. Investigators observed many participants using small off-road ATVs to participate in the contest, and those vehicles were still on the backs of the trucks when they arrived with the, kill with the coyotes that had been killed that day. As each truck arrived, <coughs> coyotes were pulled off the truck and dragged or carried to scale for weighing before they were tossed in the back of the truck. Investigators estimated there were about 30 to 40 participants at weigh-in. About 30 to 35 to 50 coyotes were killed during the, the three-day contest. Most of the participating teams brought in between two and five coyotes, but a last-minute arrival came in with 10 dead coyotes. As the participants moved the dead coyotes around from truck to scale to utility truck, investigators overheard laughing and comments about them, including, quote, this one here got gut shot, unquote. Indiscriminately killing wildlife for entertainment and prizes do not reflect the value of sportsmanship in Oregon. And what you see in this video is the true nature of wildlife killing contests, regardless of the animal. As a native Oregonian, and my family hunted, I'm from Lynn County, this is disgraceful, and it is not hunting at all. 